You already know what it is. Mikey Williams, he has been dealing with a crazy situation. I'm here to give you some updates on what's happening. Well, one situation in particular. Uh, make sure you subscribe to Flight Sports TV for more news updates and more. But Lil Reese, Chicago's very own, you already know, Shy Rat, Reese Money 300 on IG posted something specifically speaking to Mikey Williams. And um, it's pretty crazy. I think that Reese is probably one of the most qualified people to speak on this. And he stated, hey, little Mikey Williams, chill out with that goofy Lil bro, this street stuff ain't no joke. This ain't the wave. That's what that's what Reese just said and, and to Mikey, you know, and anybody don't understand who Mikey Williams is, you know, five star recruit, very highly coveted, you know, already uh committed to Memphis, gonna be coached by Penny Hardaway, God willing. We just wanna pray that none of these transgressions that just occurred is going to hurt him in his ultimate goal, which is getting to where he need to get to, you know, in my humble opinion. Um, Mikey Williams is, you know, going to be the truth. He's destined for greatness. If you don't know, he is coach, not coach, he's playing with uh, his teammate, J.J. Taylor. Uh, J.J. Taylor is from Chicago, you know, so I'm pretty sure a guy like Reese is very familiar with his game. A lot of the Chicago rappers are embracing a lot of these high school stars. As you can see, we seen we we documented Lil Durk. Now we seeing Reese, you know, and things of that nature, offering some advice to Mikey Williams, especially in this critical time where you'll see a lot of people not really trying to, um, not really trying to basically stand by him at this time. See, it's easy to stand by when everything is going well and everything is this, that, and the third. But once things, you know, take a dip or a hit happen, you know, people, you start seeing who your real people are and who's really coming to your defense. But Mikey Williams is having court. If you don't, if you're unfamiliar with the situation, Mikey Williams was arrested in San Diego, you know, and basically he was, he was basically released on a $50,000 bond and he will have his first court appearance Thursday, you know. Um, so it is it is a wild situation. There are multiple counts of assault um, in this situation. Um, we, uh, it's, I've heard so many reports from a lot of different people, so I definitely I'm gonna break some of this stuff down, you know, um, of what's going on. But basically, this is a very troubling situation. And if you're a young guy or a young athlete. You definitely might want to evaluate this situation so you don't have you don't move in this direction. Mikey Williams has the world ahead of him, and for something like this, whoever was around him, you know, they put have him in an environment where something like this could happen, including himself. Like I said, it's blame all the way around because as many chaperones and as many uh, mentors as you have, you can't monitor somebody 24/7. You understand a, a guy is going to spread his wings. He's going to make his mistakes. And as you can see, Mikey Williams, he just, he got caught up in a nasty, nasty situation, which could cost him his basketball future. We don't even know if he's going to go to Memphis. You know, we don't know what's going on with this Puma deal. You know, you just, you just, like I said, it, it sucks that all of the things that he has ahead of him. And now it seems like everything could hit the goddamn fan and it's hurtful, you know, cause I know deep down, he don't, he don't deserve this. This dude put a lot of effort into his basketball game, but you know, one little mistake could cost you everything. You understand one second, whatever happened here, like I said, allegedly, we don't know for sure, you know, if he was involved in this, but all I know is there is an investigation going on. So as more and more information come out from this investigation, I will be able to bring everything to you and keep everybody documented on what's going on. You know, um, this is a crazy situation, you know, um, involving these teams, you know, in my humble opinion. Um, <clears throat> but it, it is what it is, you know, in terms of all, like I said, you got Memphis, you got San Isidro, Puma, it's like, and then you got Mikey. So it's like, we we really don't know what they're gonna do, which direction people are gonna move in. Because let's say, um, like I said, I guess you wanna go best case, worst case. Obviously, best case, I'm gonna go best case first since everybody always say the worst thing.
But the best case scenario is all this was a misunderstanding. They got the wrong guy. It was a mistaken identity. This, that, and the third. And, you know, this story gets buried. Everybody moves on to their normal lives. And like I said, this becomes a distant. You know, nobody's talking about it anymore. Mikey Williams can go on to Memphis. His new release could drop. And it, 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 could, it could work wonders. Or the alternative is... You know, this thing could blow up in his face, you know, and in the face of Memphis and his high school, every, his family, he could let everybody down. You know, um, who knows if Puma want to pull a deal, you know, who what's going on with this sneaker? I bet it's on hold, you know, if, if they're not going to kick him out of his uh, uh, deal with Puma, I'm pretty sure that, sneak, that sneaker's on hold until this thing get rectified. They won't be doing any more promo with that sneaker. Everything is on freeze. Um, all right, what, let's go. And then, like I said, the the situation with Memphis, now, Memphis, they don't know what to do. I'm pretty sure they was very excited that he was coming. But 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 now with this aspect of things, it changes everything. We don't know if he's. We don't know anything right now. I'm just gonna keep it 100. If you think you know, you guessing. Nobody knows the future of Mikey Williams right now. His future is up in the air. It's hanging in the balance of a judge. You know, uh, to hit that hammer, you know, in order to give him a second chance, which I do believe he will get, you know, um, because from reports, everybody in San Diego know who he is. You know, so I heard initially when he got down there, it was almost like they ain't even want to really, you know, go forward. with this. So they was talking about a guy with his, um, they were trying to say a guy that looks like him or something like this. It was some wild situation, but it was Mikey Williams. It was almost like they was seeing 2020 like hold on i know that's not who i think it is who i'm thinking you know so clearly mikey williams was caught up in the wrong place wrong time and like i said you know guys just got to get put this kind of stuff behind them man mistakes do happen these are young guys you know things go on we can't act like these kind of issues have never happened before you know but just with a guy with all of the world ahead of him you would have thought that somebody could have protected him could have covered him from these kind of events, but it, it, you know what it is, man. There's no talent. There's no talent at the end of the day, man. But it is what it is. Um, Mikey Williams, he, he did try, he tried to get some advice from this man, uh, Lil Reese, man. And Reese don't understand. Um, like I said, it's good to see Reese. It's looking like he, he done been there, done that. You know, we all know his history, especially if you've been following the drill scene. Um, in Chicago, you know, Reese has definitely changed the way he's moved and the way he talks and, and things of that nature. So it's good to see him give us some. You don't really hear these stories too much. We report always the BS, but we don't hear a rapper, you know, that make certain kind of music that people say do this, that, and the third. We don't hear the documents of them coming back and trying to reel in the young man that's just took a slip. We don't we don't document this kind of stuff. But it is what it is at the end of the day. It's Flight Sports TV. Peace and love.